What's up guys, BND Gaming here, and today we will be covering the brand new Kamehameha LR Gohan and Goten. So, like these guys I've seen have been getting a lot of hate on them, and they're actually two in er, an incredible unit, I believe. I mean, they're they get they are criticized a lot for their key links, but they only have one key link and that's all right to me because as you can see here every time they attack they get another uh key so they eventually whenever they are ran uh especially with uh their own category the uh, siblings bond category they are getting a key plus 13 so that's an automatic super attack plus it's in this game it's not very hard to get uh, another five a key so we're going to be hopping in today on the hybrid saiyan super battle road so as you can see here we got a four lr team uh one free to play three gotcha i've i haven't been able to beat this yet so i'm hoping with the addition of this family kamehameha lr that uh this will be the chance but I love this team. I honestly think this is the best team right now in Doka just because it has 510,000 health. It is insane how strong that is. Uh, I just want to see how well they tank. I mean, honestly, this run through, I don't care about if I lose or win. I just want to see how well uh, they can tank this, uh, these hits for uh, without any... Uh, a, or without any uh, uh, boost to them. All right, all right, that'll be good. Let's see. I mean, they're taking a lot of AGL, so 47. Um, of course, they have type advantage here. So, all right, this will. Wow, guys, that is incredible. They just took those hits for double digits with no defensive boost. That guys, these these guys are absolutely incredible. I don't know how anybody could honestly complain about these guys. Like, see, Trunks with uh, type disadvantage just took twenty thousand. That's <laughs> gosh, these guys are so good. And of course, they have that Gohan boosting them, but that's the main thing with that Gohan. He's just a really good. Uh, unit for that so I say we're just gonna delay all the attacks here just because we don't have a very good uh, rotation for this part so uh, my what I would like to do here is obviously uh, we want to stun the Bardock or we want to seal the Bardock because uh, he's gonna be the strongest person on this team so we don't want him getting a super attack off and then we will go after you all right yeah so guys this team is honestly awesome like you could run uh i haven't had the ability to pull them yet but you can also run the uh uh lr go uh go 10 and trunks so that's a that's a five or that's a four gotcha lr team that's incredible that health that health will be like Five hundred and fifty thousand. That would be absolutely ridiculous on how high that would be. All right, so let's get these boys back up here. Let's see how well they honestly. Okay, so the they honestly link really well with Gohan. So we're gonna let Gohan uh, take a chance here. We're gonna let him stay on rotation. It doesn't look like the Gohan's gonna get a super off, but that's okay. Uh, we will just attack you and. Uh, let's get you down so we can get those tech orbs down. That'll be perfect. All right, so, gosh, guys, they, let's see what they take a super for. Not, it's, that is not bad at all for SBR. 100,000 super. That's awesome. And if you guys haven't noticed, the past two turns, they have gotten on their, on their guaranteed additional a super attack. So, guys, that's just awesome. And let's go, Han. Uh, I pull on the... Banner, I pulled a dupe for him, so he's up to 69%, and as you guys saw, he just got his additional super attack. It's awesome. Oh, this is awesome. Absolutely awesome. So, 
Let's get an ultimate off on you. Uh, let's use a... Yeah, let's use a princess. Yeah, because this, this isn't the greatest defensive turn. So let's just use a princess. Hey guys, like I said, like I would love to beat this. But if I don't beat this, I'm completely fine with it. Just because... Uh, I know I will be able to soon, uh, but I mean, whenever uh, we record and make videos like this, it's hard to focus on certain aspects of the game. So if we win, of course, that'll be amazing. But if we don't, then that is just as fine too. Oh, and guys, if you guys didn't know for this SBR, you absolutely want this trunk. See, he is so good just because he can output great damage and look how much he's tanking for. I mean, I know I have uh, an item, but it's only a 30% defensive boost, and it, he's just so good. Hopefully this Gohan uh, can take him out, and then we will pretty soon... Come on, did he get him? I think so. That's going to do... So oh, let's see, 39, that's fine. Ah, oh, so close, so close. That's all right. We'll take him out this turn. But we will absolutely take them out this turn. Hopefully we can get that Trunks, or not the Trunks, my bad. Hopefully we can get that Bardock taken out. Uh, I would really enjoy that. We will use the Gohan to take him out, and we will use our beautiful LR Gohan to add some damage on him, because I'm pretty sure that should work. Uh, I think, I'm hoping 75, that's honestly fine. I mean, we've used, out of a three, uh, three rotate, or, my bad. Uh, three, uh, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, three, out of three, uh, battles, there we go, battles, uh, out of three battles, if you only use about two items, that's great, because honestly, like, I, in my personal opinion, I think these battles where you gotta face five people, it, they are so difficult to me, I don't know why, it's just... My personal opinion i've always thought they were more difficult uh i say we go full ahead and we try and take out this uh bardock because i mean he's ultimately gonna do probably the most damage and plus he's got those last two attacks so i'm just hoping no he didn't super that's great i think we should be good here yes we are all right so we are going to take out the bardock here and hopefully we can take out the torah and that would be absolutely amazing just because we should be able to. Hopefully Trunks can crit. If he can. Oh, finally. That guy. You guys have to know this by now. He, that guy literally never crits. He is ridiculous. For having a 50% crit rate. He never does it. It's absolutely insane. Uh, so I know these uh, types of. Let's see. Okay, so three. That's not bad. Uh, so I know uh, these category SBRs have been out for a while. So I'm curious uh, what you guys are thinking about them. Like, uh, do you guys like them? How many have you been able to beat? And stuff like that. Okay. So if we take you, you two drop there. So we obviously, you were 79%, so we want to keep you there. I say let's just pop the Ghost Usher because, I mean, this isn't, like, it's a fine defensive rotation. But it's just not going to do what I really want it to do so yeah that's what I assume so we'll just get it like that there we go okay so now we got six key lined up that's a guaranteed super attack for somebody next rotation that's fine oh I forgot to change that's all right that's all right I forgot to change who I was attacking that's okay I, massive damage wasn't getting produced this turn anyway that's all right that's just what happens sometimes with the go or with the LR uh, Gohan and Goten. Uh, sometimes they aren't able to do uh, a mass amount of damage, and I mean, that's plenty fine to me. Alright, so we're gonna focus. Uh, we don't need too many. I, I would prefer not to use all those. Then we can attack this Vegeta with a ulti uh, ultimate. Alright, so I want to try and take out this Nappa. 100%. I want to try and take out that Nappa. And we should be good for Super Attack because uh, with the Family Kamehameha, because they got an extra 2 key uh, last turn from both of their uh, attacks. So 
I think we'll be good. Hopefully Trunks can do something. 1.7 here. If we can get a crit, that'd be nice. Okay, we got a crit for 1.3. Almost 1.4. That's that's awesome. It's awesome. So we'll heal after this turn. But 2.6 from the LR uh, Gohan. That's he is the first LR or the first gacha LR that came out and he is just still such a good unit. Like, he gets hit hard. That's fine. He didn't have type advantage, but that's fine. We can just always drop, like, pop the intro at 8. He's a great unit. Let's throw the family up. We will go after... Let's go after... 42, 154. So, I want to keep... Yeah, like, the... Uh, the seal tanks and the Gohan and Goten link better, but I want to keep the ultimate Gohan on rotation just because he gives that extra 50% defensive boost uh, to all of his allies. So we're going to keep him on rotation. I don't really see the need to take him off. That would just be a bad move, I believe. Uh, yeah, let's go after the... Yeah, I want to go after him. And then... We will go after... Yeah, we'll stay going after you. And then these should drop the way. Yes, they are. And we will seal you. So that should work out perfectly the way we want it to. Because obviously since we just popped the Android 8, these, these guys are going to be tanking incredibly well. Just as we saw, all double dig digit damage for two turns. So that's awesome. Always awesome. All right, so we're getting 1.2 from our uh, from our friend Ultimate Gohan. Let's see what we can get here. Oh, we're getting close there. We're getting close, and obviously he's gonna tank well since he's mainly a defensive unit just because of his uh, passive skill. And we are going to be sealing the Vegeta right here, so that is great. That's why I honestly bring this unit just because that's awesome. Plus, I have him rainbowed, so he adds that extra ability to himself. So that is always awesome. Uh, a trunk, uh, yeah, I guess we're going to leave the trunks up here. Even though he has type advantage, we are going to leave him up there just because he still has the ability to tank very well. And we're going to go after the Raditz because we want to take him out just so we can lower the amount of attacks we're going to receive. Oh, and our trunks. Okay, I didn't even think about the Doken. So, okay. <laughs> I didn't even think about that, guys. It's just what you get in the mood for, or what you just get in the flow of playing. You completely forget. So we're getting into tackle off. I kind of wish I would have focused more, but that's all right. That's all right. It's whatever. We still have what four items, and this trunks does do a good good deal of damage. So yeah, a million to everybody. We took out the Raditz. He's tanking incredibly well. We're going to be able to take, or not take out, but we're going to be able to <laughs> increasingly injure this Vegeta here. That's great. And yeah, we'll be attacking the Vegeta again because we were targeted on the Raditz. So, whew, whew. it's good. This is good. This is really the first, like, this isn't the first because some of the, uh, some of our most popular videos on the channel are the, uh, let's attack you our our uh super battle road run throughs because we think uh the reason i think that is because you guys uh are curious because i mean we uh ben and i are in the similar situation as you guys because like all these guys that are really well known for playing doken they spend thousands of dollars playing this game while ben and i we have a much less budget for the game so we're much more like you guys and we can create teams and relate to you guys uh and it's just i think an all around better connection so that's just my personal opinion i mean you guys if you guys have feedback on it you can tell me down in the uh comment section below oh man i thought we took out that napa oh, i would have loved to get this uh additional super off on vegeta but that's all right that's all right i think i don't think this will actually beat the vegeta just because SBR, damage reduction, all that kind of stuff. But if we could get a crit, well, no, we can't because I don't have any dupes. Can he finish? Oh, great. Okay, guys, so with four items left, we are hopping in to the final stage of Hybrid Saiyan's SBR. 
And we're not only an astounding about, we're probably about 13 minutes. I mean, they're double fizz, so it, it'll be good for the uh, Gohan. It will be very good for the Gohan, I think. Ooh, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I, oh gosh. I guess what I think I want to do here, obviously, I mean, I want to attack Paragus first. Uh, it's just the idea. I don't think I'm going to get hit for 510,000, but as soon as I say that, I'm going to get hit for 510,000. So, I'm going to let the two trunks attack. Yeah, I'm going to let the two trunks go for Paragus, old Paragus, and I'm going to let the... Uh, yeah, because I got to seal him in case he supers. I just hope he does a super first. Because I could take 10k damage each time. Just don't super, please. Dang. God dang. Alright. 216,000. That's not what we needed. Uh, so we'll obviously heal next rotation. I mean, we'll have... Uh, I mean, at least we're outputting good damage on the Paragus. Uh, but, oh man. If we could have gone one more attack. That's alright. It's okay. I think we'll be fine. I mean, 200,000 health. I don't think we're honestly gonna get hit for like 50,000 each time, but you never know. <laughs> like this game. Oh no. Yeah, guys, we may have died. Well, that was a mistake on my part. Uh, oh, all right, guys. Uh, well, it wasn't uh, about beating the Super Battle Road. It was more, sh more so showing off the uh, LR Family Kamehameha. And as you guys saw, they are a great unit. So, uh, I mean, that's the farthest I've ever gotten on this stage. So we will definitely have to jump back in. Uh, this has been B&D Gaming. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like and comment down below uh, telling us, uh, giving us feedback or telling us like what we should do next. See ya.